Let me bring in Andrew Stoltman. He's attorney at Stoltman Law Offices. Get a quick comment from him. How rare or, uh, or uh, common is this, Andrew? I think it's relatively rare. I mean, I think this is a real sign that Mr. Blankfein is getting some sort of an indication that either the firm is moving away from him or potentially that obstruction of justice or perjury charges might be coming out of his testimony uh, in front of the uh, Senate last year. So I, I think it's a really an extraordinary step. It'll be interesting to see how it plays out. Okay, so, you, so now why would you say obstruction of justice? I mean, do you have any evidence or reason to believe that is the crux of the problem here? Well, Obstruction I think, of evidence. Yeah, uh, I think obstruction of justice with respect to his testimony in front of Congress last year. Uh, Senator Levin was scathing in his report that uh, that he thought there was a possibility that Mr. Blankfein did perjure himself in front of Congress. And I, I'd be shocked if that wasn't what this is ent uh, entire issue is about. And, and there was also some talk about the possibility of lying under oath or perjury allegations. I guess that also could be part of this. Uh, I think it's all interwoven, and I'd be shocked if, I, that, if that isn't it. Yeah, but I guess we're all speculating here. All we know is that Lloyd Blankfein has hired his own lawyer, uh, separate from Goldman Sachs's uh, legal counsel, uh, as we uh, continue to watch the investigations deepen into Goldman Sachs and their role uh, in uh, the uh, financial upset. Andrew, thank you very much. We'll see you, you soon.